Welcome back to another Hearts of Iron 4 exploit. Today I'm going to be showing you guys an exploit that is possibly so overpowered and so broken that if you try this in multiplayer, you are probably going to get banned from several, if not almost all of the servers that you try this in. This is how broken it is. And probably most people out there assume that this is not that big of a deal. Trust me, out of all the exploits I've covered, this is probably one of the most game breaking, especially against people in a multiplayer server. So what is it and how does it work? Let me go and explain what basically pinning a division is. We're going to go ahead and attack Poland. Now we're going to let the battle go. Basically, our divisions are currently pinned because we're being attacked by an enemy division. Now, we're not able to attack the enemy division that's attacking us. And the reason that Paradox has this is because if you do attack that division, they're going to do two things. One, it's going to split off the reserves that they have left over into two different groups. So it splits half of the divisions to fight the ones that are attacking, which turns into all of your divisions attacking the enemy. So it basically forces half of their army to just vanish inside of those battles. But more importantly, because the organization that the enemy has attacking you goes down a lot quicker than defense. As we can see here, when we have it on three speed, you can tell that a lot of the Polish troops their org is already dropping pretty quick, especially this one down here compared to our troops because they're on the defense and they have really good entrenchment. They're not really dying at all. So we're going to go ahead and let this go through a couple days. Now, while this is going through, I'm just doing this so they get kind of low on org uh, right about here. Now, before I show you guys how to do this, I wanted to say I recently discovered this when I was doing my Japan playthrough and someone actually told me about it originally and I have completely forgotten their name. I am incredibly sorry to the person who told me about this several months ago. I completely forgot about it and I just recently discovered it in the Hearts Fire and Forge Japan playthrough. But enough with that, let's go ahead and get into this. I just want to say sorry to that person if they're watching. Uh, basically, here's how you do it. So now that we're being attacked and most of the enemy divisions are low on organization. Now, as we can see in battle, it's pretty much mostly our infantry divisions that are being attacked. Now, again, as you can see, we can't attack here. If we select our infantry here, they can't attack here. Now, what you do is you can just do this with one. Actually, I'll just do this with one. You can do this with any battle groups you want that are currently in combat. You select them and click the tile behind them and that basically makes your divisions begin attacking through them. Now again, the reason this is so broken is because they've already lost most of their org attacking us in battle, which means they're in a very bad state. They're really half org, uh, and basically they've lost their entrenchment. And more importantly, probably the most broken part about this is we still have most of our org. So now if we attack, and also remember it splits their divisions, as we can see they have about seven here in total, uh, six there. So really they're at about 13. Well, now if we attack, we've bumped that one down to seven and this guy down to one. So it basically, it, it's incredibly broken. It force routes divisions. And basically, like I said, this is probably the most broken thing in Hearts of Iron 4, if I'm being honest, because if, as long as you're attacking the enemy like this, and you're pinning them in the same spot, they're unable to defend themselves against you when you go on the offensive because they're already so low on organization. And again, this is incredibly broken. I would not recommend doing this in multiplayer games because it, again, is so broken that it's pretty much completely unbalanced, it's completely unfair, and more than likely is definitely one of the most broken exploits in the game. Again, because you already have lowered their organization by attacking, or correction defending and now what you're doing is literally you're just basically pushing them off with half strength I mean you can see this huge pocket we just made that quick and this is the 1939 start date scenario as Germany which Germany is already kind of strong in it but to do this through this exploit in the course of about a couple weeks and encircle pretty much the entire Polish army it's pretty broken so anyway guys I want to go and share this with you guys and hopefully you enjoyed it and also don't forget in the top right corner there should be a little card up there if you guys want to check out more exploits on my channel i have a ton of them in there anyway guys again thank you so much for watching hopefully you enjoyed i will see you guys next time and stay awesome